I'm reading one nonfiction book a month, so starting out strong with some Pema. So I read a little bit of that, and now I'm reading some of my other novel, which is a sexy novel um, by that <laughs> woman that I was telling you guys about. So just like slightly different vibes, but we're going for it. Welcome back to the channel, you guys. <laughs> All right, Blake and I are gonna go do a little aperitivo at a new place that's right down the street from us called Pistoles. Pistoles? Do you know how to say it? Pistoles. Um, and I just wanted to keep my outfit super casual and comfy. So I'm wearing my little baggy thing that I wear, this extreme cashmere sweater. Um, if you guys also follow Alana on TikTok and Instagram, you know that I'm extremely influenced by her and this was a, her purchase. Um, the Kate Danielle jeans, um, a vintage belt, and then these by far booties. And I think I'm just gonna throw on this jacket. It's like not far to get to that place. Probably should put the bag Um, but it's like literally probably two walks from us, so nothing that intense, but I just wanted like a cozy look. This jacket's by Florat, I think. Um, and part of me wonders if I should take the belt off. I don't know, Blake, what do you think? Is the belt a good look or should I take it off? What? Belt or no belt? Yeah, do the belt. Like still working. But that's okay. Are you gonna bring it or not? Yeah. He's bringing his laptop. Something just wasn't working with that outfit, so I changed. I'm wearing this. Um, Vince sweater that has this like detailing on it um, Like longer sleeves, which I love and then same jeans no belt and then these cute booties So I just feel better in this. I think this is a French place. So it's giving kind of Parisian vibes, you know yes. Good morning post yoga shower and my hair looks crazy but i'm gonna do some skincare in a second after I pull my hair back but yeah i just went to a yoga 2.0 class with my friend kate my friend jess and then our friend chris um which was fabulous so we did like a saturday morning flow i did it last week on new year's eve too and it's with this girl hannah she's so awesome so that just felt so good. I feel like I'm just having a nice Saturday. And I'm going to start, not start. I'm gonna go to Whole Foods right now. I'm pick up some groceries for tonight. I want to spend the day reading and relaxing. I don't really wanna like do a ton today. I kinda just want to have a nice Saturday um and then just have dinner in and have an early night i don't know if that's lame but that's what i'm feeling so i think that's what we're gonna do unless blake has anything else in mind blake do you have anything else in mind for today do you just have anything in mind today besides like going to whole foods reading no i'll probably do some more there we go the man has spoken but yeah yoga was really good i slept like a baby last night we got up this morning went to la cologne and got a little cafe which was fire but i really haven't drank much of it and i'm kind of sad because i usually try to stop drinking coffee afternoon and it's afternoon now oh my god um I might just drink it, fuck it. I'll be fine. 
Um, because I do want my coffee. Also, does anyone always or anyone else always wash their hands before they do their skincare? I don't know if that's like a thing that you're supposed to do. This is just vitamin C. Um, but it's something that I do. So, okay. And we're gonna do the Dew Moisturizer for a nice little glow. And yeah, I'm wearing a chocolate brown set from Aritzia actually. It's called, I think, I think it's an everyday set. It's actually really good. I've decided, because I was off Aritzia for like a year. I actually looked and I did not buy anything from there for a year. And I've slowly gotten like slightly back into it, but I think the biggest thing is just like looking at, I almost said the ingredients, but looking at um, what's actually in the, why can I, the material. Um, that will help me to make informed decisions about Aritzia and just like feeling it and feeling if it's good quality or not, because I think some of their stuff, like this set is good quality, but then there's other stuff that's like shitty quality. So I think you just kind of have to like be informed with that. But anyways, Blake, do you know what Austin and Kayla are doing today? No. Also, if anyone has any right, like one, one tip from Ryan Holiday, be strict with your other. I just messed up. Be strict with others. Or no, that's wrong. What is it? Be strict with yourself. Kind with others. So, I don't know if I like that. Strict with yourself. Tolerant with others. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about that. Be strict with yourself and tolerant of others. You know what that means, right? But yeah, but it sounds like tolerant isn't the word that I would go for for how I want to treat others. Like, do you really want me to be like, oh, I tolerate you? No, but tolerant is like a baseline. Also, if anyone has any... Yeah, I think, okay, fine. I, I think that's fair. If anyone has any good um, things for like, this is just redness, like it's gone away. I'm currently using hydrocortisone on it because that actually has helped a lot for me in the past. If anyone has any tips, please let me know. Obviously it's like redder right now because I just left yoga, so my face in general is just red, but we're just gonna leave that right on. I do this thing where I'll wear that cream in public and I just genuinely do not care. So, okay. Let's do this. Let's go get our groceries. We basically just need to get vegetables because we have meats, we have fruits. If Mary's Gone Crackers are on sale, I'll buy some of those, but I only buy them when they're on sale. Um, I think that's pretty much all that we need. Okay. I just had a really weird deja vu. Probably because I am constantly vlogging right here. Okay, I'll see you guys in a little bit. I just made sourdough discard crackers with like herbs, um, fresh herb, and then olive oil and um a bunch of different seeds and they actually turned out pretty good they're like kind of flat bready but i feel like that's how crackers kind of always are um when you make them homemade but i'm gonna put some lip balm on and then we need to go to trader joe's because our whole foods literally didn't have like any vegetables it was so weird um, the joe's one i mean we'll see if not it's not that normal but um that's our plan i just finished my newsletter and I think it turned out really well. Trader Joe's haul. Come at ya. Hot. Guys, I don't know why I always go like this. I think it's because my grandpa always goes like this. And so then I do it. Anyways, okay, I got three cards because I am a card writer. 
and I like to have cards on hand. Um, I have just like plain blank cards that I'll use sometimes, but I like having these too. So this one is so cute. It's a little thank you note. It says, thank you for being so sweet. And I just feel like it's very me. And then the inside says, um, there's no berry better than you. It's kind of lame, but I like it. This one's just completely blank. And then this one says, thanks to you, a whole bunch. And it just has a bunch of flowers. Um, apple. Have you guys ever seen Enchanted when they go, Apple, no thanks, it's good. You know what I'm talking about? If you don't know what I'm talking about, you're gonna get my head, but it's from Enchanted. Romaine to make a Caesar salad tonight, or just any type of salad. Their romaine are just, <laughs> romaine are, <laughs> their romaine is just pizza. Broccoli, lots of it. Cheese. This is such good cheese, the Kerrygold Dub Liner. Mm, maybe I'll have some right now. And then Papa. And that's it. And it's already getting dark and it's only like 4.30. So that's cool. What time is it, Blake? Is it only four? What? 4.30. Oh, it is? So can we plan our trip then? Is that what you're looking at? The correct answer is yes, but I know you're not actually oh. Why does our fridge get so full, you guys? It's just an issue. Well, that's because you got greens and then we have a bunch, of, we have boxes that are like almost empty that we just need to eat tonight. I'll make like sauteed greens or something. new crackers with either that dub liner or some Asiago. I don't know what I want yet. Hi guys, I just showered and did my skincare and now I'm cozy. And I'm gonna read my book. Blake's showering right now. So I'm gonna read and then maybe watch some Firefly Lane and call it a night. I'm honestly so excited to just like have a chill night. Saturdays are my day where I just like to like chill out a little bit like I really love on Saturdays too um I've been loving going to yoga in the morning and then just like relax like read and work on my newsletter and just like random stuff like that so I will see you guys in the morning and yeah I just organized the fridge it doesn't look organized but it is I swear I don't keep like an insanely i mean my fridge is always clean that's the thing is like i always have it wiped down i always know where everything is everything's organized but we have a lot in our fridge because we just go through a lot of food so i don't like try and my mom is like a psycho about not having anything in her fridge but i just do like fruits and stuff like that up there vegetables for cooking down there greens we have a lot of greens right now for salads for the week um any meat we're making any sort of like those are my sourdough crackers and some bread that we have cheeses and butters and then these are just our separate drawers so that's what we've got but i just did that i showered earlier and we went to coffee with austin and kayla this morning which was great but i'm gonna edit this vlog so i'm gonna end it but i love you guys and i will see you in the next one bye guys